and they'll face Sean Reed fully for the first time. He's going to be the first pitcher in charge of trying to get Gibby that win in his last game here at Rogers Center. It's going to be a bullpen day. He can be an elite pitcher. Right there, there's that wipeout slider. So the first inning, three of three down. The Chris Davinsky, 27 year old, set to make his first start of the season, sixth of his major league career, curveball changeup. And you're right, his changeup is one of the best. It's a lot different than Marco Estrada's. His changeup goes straight down. Fastball right by you. 2 2 to smoke. There's that changeup for the strikeout. First strike of the afternoon for Davinsky. It's short. They can play very well. It's short. There goes McKinney. The throw is right into the base run. And McKinney will have his first big league stolen base. Pritchett hits it high and deep to left field. And this ball's going to go. Randall Pritchett has set a new career high with a two run a home run on Chris Davinsky. Win one for the Gibby. Called strike three. Pitched him upstairs and gets the strikeout. A couple of strikeouts for Davinsky, but. Called strike three. Pitched him upstairs and gets the strikeout. A couple of strikeouts for Davinsky. His manager. Sean Reed Foley strikes out. Lourdes's older brother, Yuli Gurriel. Really enjoy it. Another good slider from Reed Foley. So he needs to come up with a reliable third pitch. How about striking out the side? Second inning, four strikeouts in a row for Sean Reed Foley. In the home run department out in Oakland. There's a little flare to left field. Kyle Tucker makes a catch. The career was over. Sure did. But I think they were just uh, all the while. There goes Marisnik, pitch from. McGuire is high. And Riznik has a stolen base, his sixth of the season. Like he's trying to get through this inning too quick. There's a line drive to right, right at the right field. And Marisnik's tagging, challenging Gritchick. And he'll move up. All right, Jake Marisnik, he's a very good base runner. Picked up. Little roller up the third baseline. This is going to be a fair ball and an RBI. So Carlos Correa, Joe Biagini, will be the first one out this afternoon after a good outing for Sean Reed Foley. Merely a shortstop. Kind of right hits it high in the air. Billy McKinney just off the warning track makes the catch. Biagini comes in and retires the two batters he's faced. Lefty, this might be his only fastball. Ball four. It was a fastball off the plate outside. 12 pitches, nine foul back. This is a fair ball. J.D. Davis at third throws in time to get Diaz. He made it close at first. Coaching him up, as they say. J.D. Davis takes a ball from Biagini. He'll go to first base. Next, Stassi, the catcher. Fly ball. Billy McKinnon giving chase, still after it, and makes a terrific catch. They got a shot at Davis. Good relay throw, and they'll get it, and it hits the base runner. Biagini knocks it down. You better get on it, Joe, and it'll be an infield hit. Check out Alex Bregman. Jake Marisnik and Birdie. Does a nice job. Marisna gets a base hit. What a nice piece of defense by Orania and Birdie. Breaking ball for the strikeout. Petrichko will leave the bases loaded as Kemp strikes out. Rondon, there's He's another, another guy that's on the bubble. McGuire hits it high and deep, and this one's going to go. Reese McGuire with his first big league home run. For lefty, nonetheless. Yeah, you, you watch these kids every day in batting practice. 3 2 pitch. Called strike three, breaking ball. Catches the outside corner, but Wire is called out on strikes. Ball game. Ken 
Giles with five pitches closes out the Astros. That's win number 792 for John Gibbons. That guarantees him a winning managerial record. What a career.